can fly, I can fly. Our version of Peter Pan is adapted directly from the original book by J.M. Barry, but we've eliminated a lot of the dated elements and condensed the uh, the conflict to be just pirates versus lost boys, uh, Peter versus Hook. And then we flipped it on its head a bit and uh, staged it to be from the perspective of uh, Smee the Pirate as a grown man coming oh, back yeah. to returning to Neverland. I, one of my favorite things about the show is it really is the true story of Peter Pan that everybody's familiar with, but it still is this compact little energy-filled ball of theater that happens on the stage. There's so many actors in such a small amount of space with all kinds of dis different instruments that never leave the stage. Um, and I just think it's this energy-filled little youthful version of Peter Pan that we've created that yeah. is really fun from beginning to end. And it, and it really is a game the whole way through. When the show starts, we're all playing a game together. And it's a really fun game. It just makes your heart really warm. It <laughs> reminds you of when you used to just be able to be a kid and play games and play pretend and mm -hmm. not have any inhibitions about it. And I think this show really is a little piece of magic. It moves really quick. Our version of Peter Pan is very condensed and it moves really quickly and you get sucked in right away. And I think you're along for the ride until the end. And from what I've heard from audience members watching it is A, a lot of laughter uh, and some tears. I think at the holidays, everyone looks to spend time with people they love and with their families. And I think that because the show relates so well to young people and to anyone who's ever been young, which is everyone, there's, there's something for everybody. The children are, you know, it's a, it's a children's piece of theater, but it's actually a, mostly a message for uh, the adults in the room to recall the time of being a child and really engage with their own sense of play that, um, you know, can be forgotten over time but isn't lost and um, is in fact, you know, extremely important. I think it's really important to everybody in the group that that it's, uh, that it's a shared and um, enjoyable experience. And I think that's so reflected in the piece. And yeah. so, like any piece of theater that is extremely fun for the people performing it to execute, those watching it can't help but have a good time. And, and, and that relationship with the audience is really at the heart of the piece. And fly, fly, fly.